We've popped down to the Aztec stand to have a chat to Chris. Chris, tell me, what does Aztec do? Well, we're a software system integrator. Um, so we work with manufacturing companies to understand their requirements uh, when, they're inter when they're interested in implementing new systems, um, which could be for uh, maybe increased production capacity or they're looking to maybe gain insights from existing processes, understand maybe where they can make improvements in, in quality and yield and throughput and all of those kind of things. Um, so we basically engineer solutions to, to address those requirements and hopefully improve their, their overall performance. Fantastic. What kind of technologies do you guys use to help create an, uh, all of these solutions? So we take um, well, basically software applications from some of our partners that, that we consider are probably best of breed um, and we use those to engineer the overall solution. So really we've got probably three, um, three pillars that we'd, uh, that, that, that we'd work at or that we'd look at, which is um, automation and control, MES and MOM and then industrial IoT. Um, so using those three pillars really to, to come up with a solution, really depending on where the customer is in their, um, I guess their automation uh, life cycle. Um, some customers are quite early in that journey, not a lot of connectivity and not much automation. Some customers are actually quite far down that, uh, you know, down that roadmap and then we tailor the solution accordingly to, you know, to provide the best outcome really. And what kind of sort of customers and clients do you have at the moment? Um, we work heavily uh, in customers in, in CPG, um, some food and bev. I know it's outside of the domain of this show, but mining and minerals and utilities, uh, also power generation, those, those types of people. But I guess for this show, we've been focused on those customers in CPG and, uh, and also food and bev. Fantastic. And you've got quite a, 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 a bit sort of map, mappable stand. Is that even a word? Okay. Um, I wanted to have a look at sort of what, what you're showcasing here and what, you're, what you're, you're telling people about when we come down. So what, what have we got? OK, so um, over on the back wall here, what we're trying to get across through this image is the idea that we're, um, you know, we're really kind of considered um, or, or, we, or we cover the entire factory um, you know, environment from even goods in um, through, through raw materials, uh, then through production processes, uh, uh, like storage, warehousing, and then also goods out. But from a manufacturing um, kind of perspective, in terms of understanding where there may be things like opportunities for improvement in these areas, this is really trying to demonstrate that whether you're looking to, uh, you know, to increase, you know, maybe you're filling in packing capacity, um, or whether there's some issues in production associated with quality or maybe throughput, um, even looking at things like energy management. Um, so if you're looking to maybe understand how to, how to optimise your energy usage or maybe drive down energy costs, then, then our solutions can provide this kind of holistic view of the entire operation and then allow you to target these individual areas then to maybe to find some of those gains, which may be marginal but, but could also be significant. So it's kind of a real must if you want to, if you're looking to optimise and analyse and kind of really get the best out of the business. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely, yeah, yeah. Fantastic. And so have you had a great show here? Yeah, it's been uh, it's been good so far. Yeah, uh, certainly yesterday was very very busy. Um, kind of rushed off our feet really. So saw saw lots of people, lots of interesting conversations. Um, yeah, today it's obviously still early doors, but but let's see. We're hope uh, you know holding out for a good afternoon, so should be good. And why do you come back? Um, I think probably the you know the number of customers that we see or the number of potential customers certainly that we see over this show there's quite a, a diverse mix of people looking for lots of different things um, but I think from our perspective not being a provider of any hardware we're looking to maybe introduce the idea that if somebody's here looking for equipment maybe there are some significant benefits also at looking at maybe refreshing some of their software systems and some of their technology and particularly around this industrial IoT which is certainly getting a lot of attention and hype in the media right now and certainly a lot of focus from from customers as well. Well brilliant I hope you get a lot of new customers here and thanks for talking to us. Thank you very much thanks.